Indigenous peoples, including indigenous women around the world, are vulnerable to multiple drivers of migration that affect their livelihood and compel them to leave their ancestral lands. The latest IPCC report underlines their vulnerability to climate change and the difficulties they face when moving in this context. As wildfires, deforestation, floods, sea level rise intensify, indigenous peoples find themselves with no other choice but to leave their homes and land while their culture is being upended alongside with their livelihoods. We see indigenous peoples relocating in small island states because of the sea level rise and coastal erosion. We see indigenous peoples in the Amazon migrating because the loss of habitat due to wildfires, deforestation or environmental degradation. And we also see indigenous people migrating to the north part of Colombia because of severe water scarcity that constitutes the main trigger of migration in the region. Today, on International Day of the World's Indigenous Peoples, we call for the empowerment of the almost 185 million indigenous women in the world and their due seat at the climate discussion table. IOM acknowledges and encourages the need to give visibility to the stories of indigenous peoples migrating in the context of climate change, or to their right to stay on their ancestral land as the custodians of primordial and elemental ecosystems that must be preserved. And we stress the need for a more inclusive participation of indigenous women in global policy debates. Their knowledge is an asset in fighting and adapting to climate change. We need to increase our understanding of how climate change and environmental degradation impacts the life and mobility of indigenous peoples in the different parts of the world. The only way to do this is through an open and constructive dialogue, listening to their stories, building on their wealth of traditional knowledge and experience, and ensuring that they fully participate in the development and implementation of appropriate responses. The International Organization for Migration engages with indigenous communities and relies on their knowledge in addressing the nexus between migration, environment, climate change and disaster risk reduction. In a flagship initiative, IOM works with the Paraguayan Indigenous Institute to strengthen the capacities of the government of Paraguay to address the mobility of indigenous communities in the context of climate change, environmental degradation and deforestation, empowering a gender focus on all activities. Helping indigenous people to stay on their ancestral lands is a priority, but as we reach the limits of adaptation, such unfortunately needs to be complemented by efforts to help people on the move or settled in new destination areas. Migration needs to be a choice for these communities and not a necessity, and IOM stands ready to listen and support.